This was the seventh annual Advocacy and Leadership Summit that the Patent College hosted. Each year the summit has taken on different themes um, and this year we really wanted to do something that was more current and something that really spoke to ways in which students and faculty uh, advocate. So we opted to do um, advocacy through vlogging and blogging. I came to talk at the Advocacy and Leadership Summit through the Patent College of Education today about using your voice through blogging. There are two speakers, Nicole and Beth, and Nicole spoke about blogging and being advocacy and starting a blog and really sh sharing and promoting how everyone has a voice. And Beth talked about um, advocacy and vlogging, which is video logging. My goal for today was for everyone in that room to know that they have a voice, know that their voice is important, and know that it can really be um, a catalyst for change for good in our community. So the first speaker was Nicole Phillips, and she talked about blogging. So first she talked about her blog, Kindness is Contagious, and this is the process of blogging, getting us inspired, how do we overcome our fears of what to write, what we do overcoming fears of how do we write, what if I'm not a good writer, what if nobody wants to listen. So she talked a lot about that and then really inspiring people to get out there and do what they feel passionate about. So the Advocacy Summit, Leadership Summit, was uh, a really good chance for me to really clarify um, things that I am passionate about and things that I do want to advocate for and actually how to kind of actually get that down into writing. I just really enjoyed um, the affirmations and really pr promoting blogging and vlogging because I do that currently and um, I, w I w needed some inspiration to like keep it going and going to this helped me personally to uh, really put things into action. Well she she really inspired me to get out and do it now so the one of the activities she did she had us sit down and write down a topic and then start making different writing prompts for it and just talking about it with our table so that pushed me to really not keep it inside anymore but get it out to everybody else and now i feel like okay this is doable i do have something to say even if only the five people at my table want to hear it somebody wants to hear it so why not and it doesn't have to be perfect it doesn't have to be this super professional thing in the beginning you can just use whatever you got something interesting that i learned or took away was that you know, your own kind of insecurities don't really matter as far as, you know, vlogging or blogging, like, you know, who's going to read it or, you know, what kind of numbers maybe, you know, you're going to, that are going to be associated with the blog. So I think that's something I'm really going to take away from that. I appreciated um, Nicole having us actually put our ideas on paper or, uh, you know, in your notes in your phone because you, you don't realize how many things you're interested in and how you can be an expert on those and how seeing other people doing it for themselves can inspire you to do it. Because a lot of times, you know, you tell yourself, you know, I, I can't do it because I'm not an expert or, you know, I'm not a professional, I'm not, you know, uh, the most creative person, but more often than not, neither was the person that started it themselves, you know. I definitely think it will affect me in the future as far as, you know, just best practices for blogging and you know, there's different tips, and I think it's always good to kind of get some information from people who do it, you know, some, some feedback. So I definitely think I'll be more likely to blog and vlog now. I love this summit because it's not just for people who are in education, it's not just for people who are in counseling or who are within the Patent College of Education, but we have people here from dance majors, theater, people who are in different student organizations, whether it's advocacy and social justice or not. I love that it's a good blend of people and everybody can get something from it. Just grateful that I did show up. I know I started off not really caring too much about it, but I am happy that, I'm, uh, that I came. The main thing that I write about and that I talk about is kindness. So to be able to come and, and share with people what it's like to use whatever their passion is um, to, to reach people is very important to me. And today it was great to be able to talk about it through, the, through blogging.